As Iraqi forces battle to retake Mosul from ISIL, almost a thousand people are being treated for breathing problems after a sulfur plant was torched near the Iraqi city. The so-called Islamic State set it ablaze on Thursday during fighting around al mishrak according to U.S. officials. No deaths have been reported. The fire was out on Saturday. <laughs> the cases presented were suffocation, he says, caused by the large fire in the sulfur factory. Elderly men and women were affected, as well as children, especially those with asthma and bronchitis and other cases. <laughs> A cloud of white smoke filled the sky where the factory is located, mingling with black fumes from burning oil wells, also said to have been torched by ISIL. Elsewhere, Kurdish Peshmerga fighters have been clashing with ISIL in the village of Batnea, near Mosul. It came as Iraqi army vehicles moved closer to the militant stronghold. Meanwhile, ISIL leader Abu Bakr al-Baghdadi was spotted in Mosul a few days ago, a Kurdish minister revealed on Saturday. He declared a caliphate and himself the leader of the world's Muslims in 2014.